<laughs> All right, is everyone ready? Is that right? Cool. All right, first of all, I'd like to address this. She says Ami was an American citizen. No, he was a possible terrorist and he was in Guantanamo Bay. All right, Guantanamo Bay. First, Bakovi you all know what Bakovi Quill is. I told you this yesterday, so I'm not going to waste your time with that. What I'm going to waste your time with is the five reasons why Bakovi Quill is the most influential court case in today's round. First, it established the intent of the criminal. The stipulation of Baco v. Quill created the intent of the criminal, which is a process that recognizes the perpetrator's intentions, leading to more applicable prison sentences in thousands of future cases. Second, uh, the concurring opinions opened the door for future right to life cases in the Supreme Court. The concurring opinions of Baco v. Quill presented the confirmation of the court's willingness to dictate the morals of physician assisted suicide and directly contributed to dozens of Supreme Court cases. Third, it clarified the 14th Amendment. Clarification of the Equal Protection Clause was instrumental in determining the maximum amount of equality our nation was entitled to and how to facilitate our fundamental rights. The case dealt with a specific double standard and illustrated how it was achieved as <coughs> equality. Fourth, it defined life in the Constitution. Our framers set out to uh, protect three things, our life, our liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. Our life and the necessity of this fundamental right is directly cited in the court's decision. It really doesn't get more influential than uh, reinforcing the Constitution. And fifth, it upheld an individual rights versus government interference case. Now, her case also deals with the rights of the individual, but when you have to recognize